Hey you guys, welcome back to my channel. It's Shannon Hearts X here and today I'll be showing you how to achieve this look. This is a yellow cut crease. I felt very summery, very yellow obviously. And I just wanted to record a get ready with me. I don't know what that was. But this video will be featuring some new products that I recently tried. I'm currently on vacation, so I said, why not do I get ready with me since I've been wearing makeup every day for the past few days. If you like this video, be sure to like, comment, share, and subscribe, and follow me on my social medias. That will be linked down below. Love you guys. Bye. All right, so I also am going to try some new products today while well, I've been using them. Um, the Juvia's Place Foundation and the stick and their concealer. So I've been using this for the last couple days and I really love it. It's really good. Really good. Um, so I'm going to start off with my... What do I normally do? Okay. I'm going to prime my face using the, um, the Philips Milk of Magnesia. I really like this stuff. It keeps my makeup really matte and literally it's a pain in the ass to take off once I'm done wearing my makeup for the day. It's hard to get off, but you know, if you want a long lasting makeup look, use this. And you guys like my vacation nails? Period. Period. Okay. Um, yeah, so let me use some of this on my face. I shake it up first. So how have you guys been? I wonder if I'm not being loud enough. Whenever I get on camera, I always feel very shy. Um, do my brows. Hee <laughs> hee. Okay. Um, so for my brows, I normally use pencil, but I've been using a an eyeshadow from the James Charles palette for my brows and an angled brush. Let me show you. I'm going to use this shade right here for my brows. It's like a black brown, I guess. This one right here on my brows. So I'm going to use my spoolie first. take my concealer by Juvia's Place in the shade 10. Now for this, I'm going to have to use the top of my LA Girl Pro Concealer too because the applicator for the concealer is like a jumbo lip gloss wand. So it won't be able to get like a precise line. So I'm going to use my tip of this. And my honest review on the concealer is that it's really good. Um, it's just a bit watery, but it has like full coverage, but it's just watery. I don't know if I like that. So if you're the no makeup makeup look kind of girl and you want full coverage, this is it. This is the only way to go. 
hate to break it to you. Now I'm gonna blend this out. Here he, I'm gonna blend it out. Y'all, my lace isn't looking A1, that's fine. Cause I've had this wig on for a few days. And it's gotten wet and all types of stuff, so. That's okay. But I will say this, they're really good. I'm not even gonna lie, these products are really nice. They feel real good on the skin. Real good. So, boom. This is what we're working with right now. And since I'm using um, eyeshadow, I use a concealer as a primer for my eyeshadow, so I'm not about to set it just yet. I'm gonna use the eyeshadow to do all of that. Now, so I'm gonna do a yellow cut crease. Um, I do not know where to start. I was gonna do pink lemonade, cause since I'm already wearing yellow, then just putting some pink, but I always do pink. So we're gonna do all yellow. So I'm gonna go in with, let me move this plastic thing out of my way. I'm gonna go back into my James Charles palette and I'm gonna use this yellow right here. This is orange, but I'm probably gonna go in that too. But for right now, I'm gonna go in here, get a good amount of that on my eyeshadow brush and just put that in my crease. So I'm going with this color. Oh, let me tell you what kind of palette this is. This is the Beauty Creations Cali Chic Palette. Boom. So we're going to go in with the shade Marina. Marina looking a little white. I don't know what's going on with her. I don't know. We about to fix this though. But whatever you one side you gotta do to the next. But I'm definitely about to fix this because Marina, I don't know what the hell is going on with her. Mm. No ma'am. So back to the James Charles again, and we're gonna take oh this has the shades on it, not true. Girl. Um, I'm gonna use Mary. There we go, much better. I'm gonna use Mary, which is this color right here. This one. Mary, Mary. Let's see if Mary will give me a little bit more justice. First of all, Mary is a whole pink. What in the hell? You finna make it work. This is actually pretty, so I'm not even going to lie. This is pretty. But I did not want to do anything with like any sort of pink or peach or nothing like that. I'm going to have to go in, just go in darker. And then it'll give me what I want. Do what you do. You and your crew. They even got plans and clubs doing it too. The more that I drink, the more slipping smooth. And nothing super boss can do shit too. I'm gonna go in with Boutique 
Cause now I just gotta jump into the browns because the other color was not the color I actually wanted. I wanted an actual brown and instead I got, first I had a dusty pink, then I got a salmon pink. So now I'm gonna use this to try to get back to what the hell I was trying to do in the first place. This is pretty. So, I'm not even gonna hold you. This is hella pretty. Wow, I'm cute. It's giving the girls cute. It's giving the girls cute for sure. Go ahead and get on up in now. Get on up in now. All right, now I'm gonna go in with 10% off. Yes, okay, so 10% off is definitely the shade. I need to just add hella depth. Off. You guys, ever since we've been on vacation, we've been getting so many, so much good vibes from people. It's been really good. It's been really good. The energy has been really positive. So it's been a really good trip so far. Honestly wishing it was a permanent thing. But you know, this how it is. Okay. Now I'm gonna go in with the shade. I'm about to just stick to this palette. The James Charles palette has everything I really need. I'm gonna go in with no beans, even though I love beans on my burrito. But no beans it is. I hear kids at the pool downstairs. We we're supposed to go to the pool, I think a couple days ago, but there were some dudes over there and they were being hella thirsty. And there was a lot of them. So we ended up not going. Now, I'm like going with Laguna from the Cali Chic thing for a dark brown shade. All right, chill. All right, works for me. Now, I'm gonna cut my crease using and my ghetto angle brush. We're gonna go in here. And just clean that right on up. I see people like they go in and then they take the makeup wipe and clean that whole section. I'm sorry, but I don't got the time to be doing all of that. No, ma'am. So I just cut it and keep it pushing with the concealer. Now I have that going in. And I'm gonna just blend it out using the same brush I used to blend the concealer under my brows and around my brows with. a little carried away um i think i want to use a little bit of dark purple from the beauty creations olivia palette let me get my titty and my shirt this has like burgundies and nudes and forest greens and shit i want to go on with this color right here
gonna go in with that bright yellow from a James Charles palette. I am going to go in with gold, but I wanna do some white. I don't know why, but I really feel for some white. So I'm gonna take that white and put it on my in, in my inner crease. Like D. And then y'all yeah, see I got some like, was this auburn colored hair? Burgundy, I don't know. I colored my hair and it looks mad cute now. And I add a little bit of this orange one in the Dan Charles palette too. If I can just find where that paper, the pack is in, I'm gonna tell you the color. Um, 518. Use a little bit of 518 too. I'm gonna push that in the corner. Just because I can, basically. And then blend it out. Yes, sir. Okay, that's cute. So, hey guys, I just finished doing my eyeshadow and applied my poppin' lashes. Now it's time for the face. So I'm gonna go in with my Juvia's Place Foundation Velvety Matte um, in the shade Molly, which is 130. I'm gonna go back in with my concealer and I'm gonna do a boop boop boop. Oh, and I got a contour stick. I don't normally use contour sticks, but I'm gonna just do like a powder, but I'm liking the effect. And this is in the shade Congo. So. A line here and a line. Let me take this and start patting it out. If you want, you can wait for it to get dry, but I don't really have time to do all that right now. So we're just do that and get start making.
name again? The contour. I'm gonna blend it upward into my highlighted area. I think I wanted to be a little bit, a little brighter on my under eye. So I'm gonna add just a toops of this soft beige. A toops. And just. Uh, Alright, now I'm going to take my Sasha Buttercup right here and I'm going to set my highlighted areas and my brows. this done I'm gonna do it all over I'm gonna use the summer hundred deep matte finish by black opal true color move on to my brows I move back to my brows again and since I set them I'm gonna just brush them out with my spoolie and then I'm gonna set them with some brow gel this is the LA Colors Browy Wowie Tinted Brow Gel. And this was the darkest shade I could find at um, Fontana. I got it in dark brown. Now to contour, I'm gonna use an eyeshadow um, from the Beauty Creations palette. I'm gonna use um, this this shade right here. I'm gonna use another eyeshadow um, in my James Charles palette. It is the shade Rusted. So it's like a, a what do I call it? It's like a salmon or a tangerine. I don't know. One of those colors.
just use some brown. So I use up here, under here. Go a little bit of dark purple. Under here. I'm gonna go back in with my Inglot highlighter and just highlight my inner skirt set. Period. All right, now let me breeze through this lip part. Also, I'll be on mascara to my bottom lashes. I'm not about to go ham with the mascara on my lower lashes because I just don't want to. LA Colors Eyeliner in the color brown, I guess. And I'm gonna just line my lips using this. I don't know, I think my makeup took me less than an hour to do. That is, that's a little like a tip. And guys, I like to overline my lips. Where do my sharpener? I like to overline my lips. One thing I wish about these um, LA color eyeliner pencils, lip liner, whatever you want to call it, I need them to be a little bit softer. They're a bit hard, and so you have to kind of rub them a little bit harder and more firm to get to use the product. I like. I feel like lip liner slash eyeliner should be soft since they're dealing with such delicate parts of the body. Next, I'm gonna go in with the LA Colors Matte Liquid Lip Color in the shade Sultry. And if I need it lighter, I just go in with my um concealer. And then, so this is what it looks like matte. Let me spray my face too. Y'all, this is a good primer or setting spray, but the nozzle low key is irritating because it don't work right. So this is a look 